All right, today, Renegade is gonna get another upgrade. Getting a hitch, baby. So since we're gonna be getting this hitch installed, let's uh, bust into the box, see what we got. There it is. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't think that came with bolts for a second because they weren't in the box. <laughs> but they were taped right here. All right, so that's the hitch. It's actually pretty heavy. Also got the wiring harness as well. It's supposed to just plug and play. We will see if that works. Supposedly, this is gonna just bolt right on. We'll see how that goes. I'm really hoping this works out and it uh, it's good. It, the length i've heard some reviews said that it was too short but then other people were saying that it's because they weren't locating the plugs right or routing them right so i'm just hoping it works we'll find out okay looking at the back of this right here it's supposed to just bolt right up here so let's give it a shot and like always i don't know if you can really see it rainstorm right there starting to rain oh well, guess what guess i'm gonna be getting a little wet because it's going on right now because we don't got time to mess around okay under here i have a bolt on this side and a bolt on that side just finger tight and then this also i'm gonna need to take the bumper cover off so i can get this piece up here and bolted there that was actually a lot more difficult than I thought it was just because it was awkward and lopsided. So, um, but now that they're in, I did not put the washers on these bolts uh, just because I was just trying to get it up there. Now I got to take the washers and bolts and turn them on. Pretty simple. It seems like it's going to line up real easy, just like so. Thread it in into these holes just got to adjust it make it fit brady why aren't you working in the shop because it's full of crap <laughs> but uh i'm gonna get these measured up here get a socket ratchet and then i'm gonna also have to get a screwdriver so i can undo the uh, uh the bumper cover once i get those done then we'll get everything bolted in Get the bumper cover back on and we should be done after we wire it. What's awesome, there's already threads there for this centerpiece here. Already threaded, so I don't need to take the bumper cover off and just get these started. And then they get this lined up. That's fantastic. Honda for the win. This literally lined up and is a plug and play basically just bolting it on and ready to rock it's fantastic all right let's start with this part I gotta take the tail light off of these two once we take these off I'm gonna wire it up from the bottom plug it in and then pull it across so then all well, this wire is gonna go to the passenger side right here 
plug that in there. On this tail light clip, you have this little clip right here, or this tail light plug. This little clip, you want to push that down. It'll pull it off that uh, bracket there. And then you're going to push this tab right here. Mine was stuck a little bit, so um, just make sure you're getting that depressed all the way. That way you can pull that out. What we're gonna do is we're gonna plug it in. We're gonna route it up through the bottom and plug it in here, right through here. It's gonna be right behind the bumper cover on um, that little piece of light. We're gonna wire it up through that, plug that in so it's protected and back there. All right, the way that I got through is I actually connected some aircraft wire um, through it. That way I could pull it up through the bottom there. Uh, it was a little bit tight, so you'll just have to finagle it around a little bit. Now I'll just plug those in button that side up move on to the passenger side okay with these bolts i'm only hand tightening those right now just in case for some reason i gotta get back in there um but yeah so hand tighten that just so everything's put back together out of the way and then I'll, at the very end i'll come tighten up uh everything with the wiring trailer hitch is obviously already on um but uh we're gonna finish up this harness and tighten everything up and we should be good to go ready to pull stuff so we provide you with some double-sided tape and part of the for part of this uh, the black box the relay or something um, I'm going to use this as well as a screw to hold that relay box on there because I want to make sure that it's very secure so looking at this all right on the driver's side I'm gonna put this right here and then this I'm gonna stick to it and then also screw it in and then grounded it here and then I just gotta tie up the wires around the front here but tie up the wires and it'll be good to go okay so this is the hitch bolted bolted there and there obviously I don't have an exhaust right here so that was definitely helpful to get in there then the wiring I just routed this here until I get a actual ball and tongue for that um, I'm not sure exactly where I want to put it but grounded it here there's a driver side right here Put that box, that tape here. Just zip tied this up for the moment. You gotta figure out exactly where I wanna permanently put that. And for the moment, since I don't have my exhaust, I just zip tied that here. That way it's a, out of the way and not rattling on stuff. Yep, there it is. Not sure exactly where I'm gonna put this, but for the immediate, it'll work. Another upgrade, baby. Hope that video was helpful. And I'll be doing a full upgrade video uh, probably the next couple weeks with everything that I've done on Renegade since I bought it. Also give you prices and all of those things so you know how much money I've put into it, if it's worth it for you. Maybe you would want some things, maybe not want some things. Um, but yeah, I'll try to get a very detailed um, upgrade video for you here in the coming few weeks. I'm getting really excited about this trip down the Pony Express and, and the extraterrestrial highway from Vegas to St. George. It's going to be epic. It's going to be a huge trip. It's happening in about five weeks-ish, five to six weeks. Um, and it's going to be amazing. So... Stay tuned. Thanks for the support, guys. Like, share, subscribe, as always. We'll talk to you all in the next one.